G'day everybody, Matt Dorn from Lawn Porn. Get your lawn on. I'm just going to discuss and share my costs for servicing the Mow Master. First off, everybody, I just wanted to say thank you. I've had some time away. A lot of people know what has happened to my Blue family. Yeah, it's been a difficult time, definitely, and I just needed that space. It was really difficult uh, to get through, especially uh, being alone in some remote areas and you know, no one to really talk to about it. I just wanted to thank everybody for their support. The times that I did have some internet, it was really um, nice to see the messages of support and condolence and super appreciate that. Okay, straight into it. Let's look at the bill, shall we? Uh, I've got my computer reading glasses on now here we go so uh, this is the invoice hopefully it comes up on your screen uh, good but uh, the instructions I gave is um, well they asked what the uh, issues were with the machine and I just said look the reel and the blade need sharpening it's uh, a year old so I don't think there's too many problems but could you check over in service the motor and check over all the bearings and everything like that so they asked if I wanted to be quoted before repairs I said no because I sort of knew what I was uh, going to uh, get anyway so replace the uh, spark plug replace the oil uh, replace uh, fuel replace air filter uh, fitted and adjusted reel clean the carby and clean air filter housing so all good there the spark plug was nine dollars uh, and then going down to the next uh, page of the invoice, uh, the Honda air cleaner was $25.20, an oil change was $9.50, fuel was $2.42, put a bit of fuel in it, which is nice, and the mechanic labour, three hours charged at $99 an hour, and that's pretty normal. Um, they've got a take the reel out of the mower and you know send it off and everything now the reel sharpening is not actually done at Delmax it's uh, done in Adelaide for me so they've got to freight it in and freight it back so for the sharpening of the uh, cylinder and the uh, bottom blade uh, $145 that's including the freight I assume so that's not a bad price uh, all things considered but quite quickly um, five hundred and eight dollars and the most of it's being labor um, obviously engine servicing and doing all that uh, looking at all the bearings and uh, putting taking the blades out and putting them back in so it all adds up five hundred and eight dollars and twelve there you go freight uh, was twenty dollars and they're thanking me for uh, my uh, custom and I love Del Max so that just gives you an idea I thought this was a good video to do simply because it's uh, it's something you really have to figure into your purchase of a cylinder mower is your service costs uh, I do this about yearly yeah look I don't back lap um, I'm kind of uh, yeah a bit wary of back lapping um, I just like a fresh grind um, but look Put some comments in the description if you backlap and uh, what your experience is like with that. Look, I use my mower um, between spring and uh, right through to about mid-autumn. And it's around about that uh, early autumn, mid-autumn, that it does get blunt. With the Mow Master, even though it is a little bit blunt during that time, uh, I didn't see really any difference in the cup quality. Um, but I'm sure if I kept going with it, it would get worse down the track. So yeah, I just wanted to put that little uh, video out just to uh, help you with your cylinder mower journey and see what you're in for. Of course, you could uh, do things cheaper by doing stuff yourself. I don't have time and uh, all the patience or the mechanical skills. So that's why I get a mower shop to do it and it supports them. And look, I know that I'm getting a good job and I'm getting it done. So that's why I wanted to share this video. If you like what you're seeing, give us a like, subscribe to the channel. We've got lots of great things happening this 
upcoming growing season we've got uh, new mowers that we're looking at um, we've got uh, we've got new products coming out uh, and yeah I can't really speak about it beyond that stay engaged with lawn porn and look support your local shops and everything else it really um, is just a, a great thing thank you very much see you later